Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Story of Sam, and welcome back to a brand new NBA 2K22 video. And today, I'm going to be sharing with you guys the fastest way to get all of your defensive badges in NBA 2K22. If you guys are brand new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below. We are on the road to 3,000 subscribers. And of course, guys, make sure to drop a like. Without further ado, let's go straight into it. So one of the first things I want to say is, you can either have your difficulty on Pro or Hall of Fame difficulty does not matter when it comes to defensive badges it's basically all your personal preference because of course the ais are a lot better on defense but if you're playing defense on the ais it really doesn't matter what your difficulty is i still like to play on pro difficulty and on five minute quarters that is my preference but of course it's not like a mandatory thing play on any difficulty and i also do want to say that defensive badges are a category where you can earn them naturally you can earn them in park you can earn them in rec center there's no like super easy way to get all your defensive badges there's no like glitch method so it's the take a little bit of time defensive badges are one of the most difficult categories to get finishing and defense are probably the most difficult so definitely strap in you can play park or like my career i still recommend playing my career because it'll still be faster than park what i mean park is more fun but i recommend my career and what you want to do is starting off if you're a point guard you want to go for as many steals as possible in the gameplay we're seeing i'm pretty sure i got like eight or nine steals in a pro five minute quarter game so just press the ball handler if you are a guard try to get as many steals as possible and definitely make sure you have on the badge pickpocket obviously once you start earning some defensive badges that will help you out a lot when getting steals steals are definitely one of the most important things when getting defensive badges pretty obvious steals blocks rebounds good shot contest all that stuff is really really great but for guards it's a lot more difficult because you can't really get a lot of rebounds if you're a guard with minimum wingspan it's going to be very difficult to get blocks so that's why i say it's a lot more difficult for like point guards to get badges shooting guards to get defensive badges now for big man it's a lot a lot easier for big man to get defensive badges if you're a big man you can get them naturally as i said just getting normal rebounds playing online game modes blocks all that stuff i recommend trying to bait the ai into passing into who you are guarding once that that happens your guys the ball you're in a great spot to get either a steal block rebound or a good shot contest just make sure that you are defending the ball most of the plays because obviously if you're not defending the ball there really isn't that much defensive badge points to be earned make sure your guy has the ball spam him try to block him do all that stuff definitely box out get blocks because that is the fastest way to go there really is not that much to say about defensive badges honestly guys you don't even have to grind defensive badges in my career you can if you want to get them the fastest way possible but if you don't really care about getting them right away just play park play the online game modes you will get a lot of defensive badges really fast especially if you are a big man again big men have it a lot a lot easier than point guards point guards it will take a decent amount of time playing online game modes but honestly guys it's really not that difficult if you're a point guard spam steals up the court every single time put on pickpocket if you are a big man try to bait the ai into passing into your guy block him get good shot and test play perfect defense and go for every single rebound in my career and in park because that is one of the best ways to get your defensive badges in nba 2k22 anyways guys i hope you enjoyed today's video on the fastest ways to get your defensive badges in 2k22 i know it was really short and that's because there really is not that much to say on how to get defensive badges it's pretty simple there's no like glitch method or like jobs to method like there is for shooting badges so just do the basic things steals blocks rebounds those are the most important things good shot contests as well and you should be on your way to maxing out your defensive badge category in 2k22 if you guys did enjoy today's video make sure to hit that subscribe button down below we are on the road to 3,000 subscribers and of course guys make sure to drop a like on today's video that would be great i'm gonna leave an end screen right when this video finishes to two of my previous uploads that i think you guys would really really enjoy so have a great rest of your day guys it's been story of sam and i'm out peace